In this video, I am going to be showing you how to run TikTok ads for your dropshipping business. Now, either you are in Nigeria or any country you are, this video is going to be teaching you on how you can be able to run TikTok ads as a beginner. So if you are new to this channel, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and turn on the bell notification icon and expect more videos on advertising, digital marketing, Facebook adverts, Google ads, YouTube ads, dropshipping and business business ideas so let's get straight into it without further ado so how do we run tiktok ads for drop shipping in nigeria or in any country you are watching this video from now listen to me very carefully my name is ayo tiktok ads is one of the best kind of ads you can be able to use for your tiktok for your drop shipping business believe this or not the answer is yes listen to me very carefully now if you are in nigeria or you are in any country that does not support tiktok ads listen to me very carefully i can be able to help you open a tiktok ads account if you're in nigeria and by so doing i'll open the tiktok business account for you i charge for this this is not a free service and you'll be able to run your tiktok ads and i'll also show you how you can be able to pay successfully for this advert on tiktok ads and you can also check this channel click on the channel name you scroll down you also see some you might see some videos that will show you how you can be able to open a tiktok ads account in nigeria or in any country you are to be doing right now is my ads account is set do you understand so i'm just going to click on create campaign now once you click on create campaign the next page by which you're going to be taking to is the place by which you're going to be selecting the objective you want to you know use for your ads let's say for instance we have reach we have traffic we have video views we have community interaction which is for followers we have app promotions lead generation website conversion and product sales now listen to me very carefully the three type of objective by which you can be able to use for your drop shipping okay listen to me is traffic website conversion and product sales why did i see this because they are actually optimized for driving traffic into another website so for this one now is mainly for traffic do you understand if you just want to get traffic to your website and by so doing you drive those traffic to your website they can be able to take any action they want to take and for this website conversion you will be able to you know track those people who are actually going to the website you know for them to be able to take a particular action and for this product sales sell products from your tiktok shop website you for this we are all newbies into this let me just say we are all newbies <laughs> you get what i'm saying even for the fact that i've been doing this, this tiktok ads for the past two years we are going to be using traffic here okay which says send more people to your website do you understand send more people to your tiktok shop do you understand so this is a beginner tutorial so if you are new to this channel don't forget to hit the like button subscribe and turn on that bell notification icon immediately for we have the campaign name the next thing i'm just going to do is just going to clear this off and you know name my campaign which is going to be drop shipping add one okay this is just a demo ad i want to use for you so i'm just going to scroll down you're going to see something like special ad categories you can you, you can click on it your our ad is not about housing employment credit so we're just going to ignore that and the next thing you want to do right now is you're going to click on continue here you see continue under the screen at the right hand side click on continue and the next page we're going to be taking to is the place by which you're going to be setting your ads set the first thing you're going to be seeing on the page right now is ad group name this ad group name you can decide to clear it up and rename it but for the fact that we've named our campaign i don't think this have any need or effects on our campaign or ad in general so i'm just going to leave that set so for this optimization location i'm just going to select website which means send traffic to your website okay send traffic to your shopify store or send traffic to your particular website you've created for the international buyers to land on and by so doing they can purchase from you whatever whatever so let's go down then on the placement you're going to see the placement here you want to tick off this automatic placement and click on select choose your targeting placement so let's click on that 
then the moment you click on that you're going to be seeing different kind of platform by which you're going to be placing your ads on you're going to see tiktok which is the main platform we want our advert to show and you're going to see global app bundle pango i don't know about this kind of app so i'm just going to tick off these two apps because we don't we don't this is not where our audience is and we just want tiktok uh platform okay so you're going to see beside this tiktok under it you're going to see a check mark which says include search result now you could decide to input you could decide to you know tick this on if you want your ads to show on search result but me for the fact that i know that tiktok is not a search engine like google ads or youtube ads do you understand uh i'm just going to tick it off okay so if you want me to create um content on google ads or youtube ads for drop shipping you could drop your comments in the comment section and by so then i can be able to create it in future videos so i'm just going to select that we've selected tiktok so we're just going to scroll down and once you scroll down you're going to click on advanced settings now listen to me very carefully and pay attention here you're going to see something like user comment now it is important that you leave the user comments that is people can actually drop their interest how much is this how much do you sell it do you understand so these are the user comments and this can even help your video to be pushed more viral if you stop running ads now you can see the one of video downloads now you have to understand that some people might even save this video for later so you have to understand that some people might even save this video for later for them to be able to you know maybe they want to buy the product later or probably they will just want they just like the product do you understand and for this video sharing you could tick it on leave it on or tick it off probably maybe <laughs> you could tick it off if you don't want people to actually share this video out and just you know so you could tick it off if you don't want this video to be shared out probably maybe you don't want people to copy your type of product do you understand your product is a very exclusive one so you don't want people to copy it you don't want it to just go viral like that why some people want it to go viral by which they can even get what so you can decide whatever you want here and let's get on with it so let's scroll down right now and in the targeting you're going to see something like targeting you're going to see save audience we don't have any saved audience here so it is empty as of now okay so the next thing we are going to be doing right now is we are going to see something like custom targeting which says manually set criteria for what kind of user you want to show your ad to and the automatic targeting which is optimized targeting based on your objective creative and performance whatever whatever so for this we are just going to be clicking on custom targeting because we want to have every form of power over our ads don't forget so let's go down a bit and once we scroll down you're going to see something like demographics now listen to me very carefully of course i'm in nigeria or wherever you are one of the best countries to target for your dropshipping business is united states so this is selected already so you could just click on this box below it which says search or select locations um you can see the type of location by which you can target here unfortunately nigeria is not is not in this location and some other countries you might be do you understand it's not located here as for this we have canada egypt kuwait morocco qatar saudi arabia south africa south korea let me scroll down turkey arab emirates and united states so for this kind of ads you can choose only united states if that's where you want to target i'm going to target canada too do you understand so these are the two places i want to target for my drop shipping and uh, it depends on where you want to you know actually do your business it's all left to you so i'm just going to scroll down then i'm going to see the all the languages so i'm just going to click on that all and i'm going to type in english i want people who are speaking english depending on which language your drop shipping video is going to be speaking about or is rendered so you're going to see below it you're going to see something like gender okay if your product is for male select only male if it's for only female select only female and it's for all if it's for both male and female select all okay if it's for both male and female select all then in the age okay let's scroll down a bit so that we can see it very well in the age you're going to see all if you want to target all ages and you're going to see the second one which is 13 to 17 if your product is for them 
probably i don't think 13 to 17 actually have money to buy anything we have the one of 18 to 24 25 to 34 35 to 44 45 to 54 and 55 plus it depends on which type of audience you want to target for your product so for my own product let's just think about it for drop shipping products most of the decision makers are like between the age of 25 to 34 you understand and those who are you know already making money who are parents are uh, between that same 25 to 55 so i'm just going to select my own audience 25 to 34 do you understand it depends on your product too if you are selling toys depends on your product so that is it now below it you're going to see something like spending power i want you to pay more attention to this place this is a bonus for you so spending power users typically typically spend more on purchases than the average user that is how did they get this kind of metric these are people who love to buy gifts for people on live who like to purchase things on tiktok through the you know through some people who are also running ads like you so tiktok have been able to classify them in a category that these people are high spenders on tiktok do you understand they've been able to input their card in the last 30 days 60 days one year or whatever do you understand frequently so you are going to be thinking that click on high spending power and by so doing then you're going to see something like household income you can you are good you can click on it you can click on top 50 of zip codes whatever whatever so i'm just going to leave this on all we don't want to mess up anything we are newbie right yes let's get straight into it so let's scroll down then the next thing you're going to do you're going to see something like audience let's click on this audience what's here okay let's just leave it like that then you're going to see something like a box which says include just leave this alone okay leave this alone then let's scroll down and you're going to scroll down to the interest and behavior tab now in this place this is where you are actually going to be defining your targeting listen to me very carefully this is the art of your advert this is the art of your advert you don't want to make any kind of mistake in this place because if you actually make a mistake here you are going to be getting a wrong targeting and you are going to just be wasting money anyhow because the people you select to be targeted here are actually the one that will see your ads so if you are if you target the wrong audience for your particular drop shipping product that is waste so you can contact me through my link in the description box or the website either one maybe my whatsapp link or website just make sure you get to me i can be able to craft out an audience for you and i will ask you your drop shipping products what type of products do you see, do want to sell to these people and i'll be able to craft out that audience for you and listen to me very carefully it's not free because it's actually my service do you understand so for this type of video i'm not going to be giving an actual audience in this place because i don't want you to go and make mistake and actually say ah mr you give us an audience that we actually copied it i'm not getting any sales so i don't want you to uh, blame me for any so just click on the box be below that interest and behavior uh, you're going to see something like targeting by video interactions creator interactions hashtag interactions appliances finances financial service travel games household products what a beauty and personal care news and entertainment now if your products falls under beauty and personal care you could just go down and you see oral care oh sorry let's click on this beauty beauty and personal care and we actually scroll down okay so see different kind of categories under beauty and personal care you're going to see something like oral care health hair care wig and hair styling skin care cosmetics fragrance and perfumes uh feminine care whatever whatever you could choose the category by which your drop shipping products uh you know lies in so for this i can just say okay fine me i'm into let's say i'm into beauty here do you understand and i want to sell something like um what could i say like toothpaste i could just click on beauty and i click on uh oral care let me see other categories that is under oral care and let me go down and you're going to see something like teeth cleaning okay teeth whitening oral care kits toothbrushes and tools so me i have a product that help people to be able to you know whiten their teeth so i want to choose teeth whitening you understand because that is actually my product and by so doing once i do this 
and then this is enough for me to be able to you know target just as an example in this video you're going to see my audience in canada and us which is narrowed down to 6.8 million to 8.3 million do you understand so that is that okay you're going to be seeing them like this age 25 to 34 only and that has high spending power do you understand so let's get on with it let's scroll down then you're going to see something like device do you understand if i click on this device then i can you know choose to say maybe i want to target only android user by clicking on only android or choose to say maybe i do i want to target people who are using iphone only do you understand so that is another form of level of targeting do you, do you understand but of course you could decide to choose anyone but some people will want to go more strict do you understand on this type of ads that they want to say okay fine i want to target only people who are using iphone why because i know people who are using iphone logically let's just come to this logical reasoning logically they might be more richer than so of course i know most of you want to say no it's a lie some rich people also use android now we're going to be selecting this iphone and based on their os do you understand os let's say for instance we choose only iphone i want to choose i want to choose only iphone now or probably you you can decide to choose only you can decide to choose all so i want to choose iphone then the os versions which is below i'm going to click on it then i'm going to scroll down let's scroll down here i'm going to scroll down do you understand and i want to scroll down i don't want to choose it and i'll just go and choose okay from iphone from iphone let's go down let's go down we're going to scroll down then i want to choose let's scroll down okay we are scrolling down using that uh, navigation button down down and i want to target from iphone 12 and above do you understand once you click this you can see my audience back to four point something million to five million something do you understand so you can see this and you can even choose to you know target iphone 15. let's see if it's included in this place iphone 12 13 14 15 you can see iphone 15 you understand so you can choose them based on that those iphones do you understand hey you get what i'm saying so on the connection type just not just leave it to all do you understand you can decide to choose 4g 5g what just leave it to all you don't care the type of connection they are using to connect to tiktok so on the careers just leave it in all internet service provider leave it in all device price you can even target people based on the price of their devices wow so just leave it at any price because we know that the price of iphone 12 and above is not is within the it's not something small do you understand according to nigeria here so it's normal now it falls within the normal average people classy people in the us do you understand so you know that let's go down then you can decide to save this audience we can click on this save audience and once you click on this save audience you can be able to use it for later so i'm not, I'm not saving it right now this is this ad is a demo so let me just go down right now and in the book you're going to be seeing something like budget which is daily budget do you understand or you want to use lifetime budget but for me i would recommend you use daily budget and for this daily budget you're going to click on you can see the default amount here 30 dollars let's try to input 10 dollars i know 10 dollars cannot do anything for dropshipping i just want to bring out a point to you to know the least amount the tiktok allows you to use for daily budgets let's just input 10 dollars and let's see if it's going to be accepted you can see something right now your budget must be a number between twenty dollars and nine million nine hundred and ninety nine thousand to nine hundred and ninety nine dollars do you understand so as for this let's say for this advert we want to spend the budget of five hundred dollars do you understand we'll just input it here do you understand so or probably if you want to spend twenty dollars just put it there twenty dollars is the limit lowest you can spend so for drop shipping you should know that you, you should spend more higher so for the schedule you're going to see something like set start time to run ad group continuously so you can see the time here do you understand i will not want you to tamper anything with this so let's just go down and once you 
so let's just go down okay it is down already then we click on next you can see this next button which is pink below here click on it and once you click on it you are going to be taken to the section by which you are going to be doing and setting your creative that is your advert creative the videos the whatever whatever the video that display the product do you understand you get that so you're going to see something above here you're going to see something like smart creative ads create ads with smart creative by auto generating videos that no no we don't want this do you understand we don't want this so in the ad name you can choose to you know rename your ad name but for this we've named our campaign so you could just edit this into your stuff into whatever you want to edit let's go down so we scroll down you are going to see something like identity use tiktok account to deliver spark ads do you understand so if you if you tick this on you'll be required do you understand if you tick this on you'll be required to you know link your tiktok account okay to this uh to the tiktok ads platform you can see my own tiktok at tiktok account linked already io is marketing aim you are expected to follow this account on tiktok right now just as you watch this video finish just io is marketing aim do you understand just go there follow my account there are more freebies going to be dropping there about drop shipping ads marketing make money online and in general so i didn't mean i didn't link my account here do you understand you're going to see something like use another authorized account or post do you understand you'll be you'll see a button here to link it i will show it on the screen i can show the screenshot on the screen so my account is linked already or if you need help about that you can even chat me on whatsapp or uh, uh, using the link in the decision box we can be able to solve that so all you just need to do is scroll down then once you scroll down you see the preview of your ads here we've not set any video here do you understand so you're going to see something like add details and you're going to see let's go down you're going to see something like ad format tiktok post or single video do you understand so add creative in this ad creative you're going to see something like post okay tiktok post or tiktok video so you're going to select tiktok post now when you select this tiktok post this is actually going to take you to your tiktok account where you have posted the video of this product do you understand so let me just click on tiktok post right now then i will be told to select a video that has already been posted on this linked tiktok account to this tiktok manager and by so doing you'll be able to use it to run so let me just say okay all these videos are about marketing this is you know this is a demo ad now so i'm just using this video as an example so let me just select one here and once i select the recent one or whatever product you want to promote i'm just going to click on confirm so once i click on confirm you are going to be seeing the video which i just chose on you know from my linked tiktok account which i want to use to represent my tiktok ads drop shipping ads you're going to see it here so let's scroll down and you're going to see something here below is you're going to see music sharing allow users to use your music in their videos just tick this leave this like that don't tick it on you understand just tick it off okay you are not doing you are not a musician so i would recommend this to those who are trying to promote music do you understand so just go down then once you go down then you're going to see something like test you're going to see uh the text now listen to me very carefully you want to make sure that the whenever you are trying to upload that video on your tiktok account make sure that you are using the official test that you want to show on your advert so it's just like you are creating when, whenever you want to upload your video on tiktok it's like you are creating you are doing the advert creative in that place do you understand now so should in case you want to use it in this tiktok as manager the test is not editable here just for you to be able to note that so let's go down you're going to see something like call to action customized call to action test let's click on it then let's click on edit okay and um, by the you can click on view selected text okay once you click on view selected text then you can choose any uh call to action you want to learn more download shop now sign up contact us apply now many more like that do you understand watch now read more order now do you understand so i would i would i would just uh advise you to click i will advise you to 
use shop now do you understand or you might even use order now you're going to see order now here do you understand you're going to see order now do you understand you can see order now there so use this shop now once you use this shop now then you're going to scroll down you can see your advert on the right hand side here do you understand so just leave it like that then in the destination url the website you're going to click on that box below it which says url enter url starting with http do you understand so click on it make sure you input h t t p okay http double whatever they call it and slash slash then you're going to input the web address so for me i'm just going to input a demo web address i might be covering it on the screen right now so this is done and they are going to be checking the website if it's actually correct right now something will be rolling here do you understand so let's see this one issue could not could get your ads disapproved let's see it right now let's see it enter a url starting with https do you understand so in this place now you can see now if i didn't make this mistake you wouldn't know you can see http is what i input here so you want to make sure that there is s in front of the p and let's see if it's going to load they are going to load it again and actually see if there's another error you can see it's loading and let's see if it's actually perfect it's still loading and you can see it there is no error again okay note this now on this website you could choose to preview the link of your store do you understand you should know that the store your store link is that which you are going to input into this place correctly so you can preview it to check if the website you click on preview is going to open another new tab okay once you click on it this is going to open a new tab here do you understand so that is it so i'm just going to scroll down and you're going to some, see something like direct users to a deep link first just leave that don't don't tamper with that just scroll down and um you are going to see the ad here do you understand how it's going to show i'm going to see something like shop now here so just go down i'm going to see something like by checking this box just tick these two boxes and you go down you're going to see all this tracking whatever you're going to see this tracking whatever we are not tracking anything for now we are newbies and you are going to click on submit you can see submit here now immediately you click on submit your advert is and if your advert follow their policy they are actually going to approve your ads and your ads will start running on tiktok and you'll be getting traffic to your landing page your store landing page maybe shopify your drop shipping store whatever website you've created for it and i said you, you'll be able to learn more sales and see people click on, on the products they want and you get what i'm saying